Hi there, let's look at a macro multiple choice question, which this time is focusing on the Keynesian aggregate supply curve. And here's the question. As the economy nears full employment, what happens to the aggregate supply curve? It tends to do what? Let's go through the answer. This is all about the Keynesian aggregate supply curve. What happens as the economy reaches its full employment level of output? Does it become flatter? No, the output, the answer is not flatter. Aggregate supply will be flat when the economy is at low capacity, capacity utilization, that is when the economy is coming out of recession. Will the aggregate supply curve tend to become steeper? Yes, that's the correct answer. Aggregate supply tends to become more inelastic as an economy reaches full employment. I'll explain that in a second to you. It won't shift to the left. Uh, the change in aggregate supply curve, yeah, there's no change in necessarily in aggregate supply conditions. It won't shift to the right. And a shift upwards is the same as a shift to the left. The aggregate supply curve will become steeper. Here's why. This is how we draw a change in aggregate supply curve. When we take, for example, a shift in aggregate demand from 81 to 82, uh, we draw it as elastic because the economy has plenty of spare capacity. Aggregate supply is highly elastic. However, as we get to higher levels of uh, GDP and employment, for example, an increase in AD from 83 to 84 causes quite a big rise in the general price level. Uh, because and again from 84 to 85 because aggregate supply is inelastic output is getting close to full capacity levels so when the aggregate supply curve becomes vertical the economy has reached full employment of factor resources uh, full employment defined uh, conventionally as the state of play when everybody who's willing and able to work uh, has a job uh, YFE is full employment at Y1 the economy is below full employment has a negative output gap. But the key point is that as, this, as the um, economy moves towards full employment, the aggregate supply curve is becoming more inelastic because the economy is running up against capacity constraints. And that's the answer to that question.